Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. <clears throat> so, I have, I'm going to call this part one of my Hobby Lobby clearance haul. Um, I was going to do it all in one and I decided I'm going to break it up into two. Um, so, uh, part two is going to show tomorrow. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around a spell. If you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Ding that bell next door if you want to get notifications of future videos thumbs up likes always appreciated and any questions or comments please leave them down below with that we're gonna get started with the only non clearance item that I bought and it was these four this four sheets of paper for a dollar it is just regular um, the paper studio paper and of course I had to get it because of the anchors I would have gotten more, but they didn't have any more. So there is that. So again, that was four for a dollar. Then I guess we're going to go here. I picked up some of the, you know, like journaling books, um, like sticker books. They were all on clearance. There was, there was a ton of stuff on clearance. There were some wonderful journal, um, like planner books and everything, but I just, I, I have enough of them, so I just passed on them. So I got two of the <clears throat> Paper Studio Agenda 52s, and as usual, y'all know me, I never pre-open anything, because that's just how I roll. Honestly, I never think about it until after I get started on the video. So this first one is called Boss Babe. And it says there's 470 pieces. And this just doesn't want to come off in one piece. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm so excited, guys. I am off the next four days. I haven't had a long time off in quite some time. This was normally $9.99. It was marked down to $2.49. So, I love these girls. These are the girls that I love. I know a lot of people love the other ones. What are the, um, the watercolor girls? They are not my style at all. So, I own none of them. And, the wrong, to me, the wrong, wrong girls, they're... I guess they're too, they're too, um, I don't like how kind of, even though they're drawings, they look more real. I like these better, if that makes sense. So smart girls rule, boss girls unite, coffee date, stay golden. I've got my warrior princess pants on. <laughs> That's funny. And then all I do is plan, do your hair, and wear your hustle. So, and I love the color palette um, with these girls. So that was one of the reasons why I got them. So, there is that one. Then I got the one that's called Pet Sticker Pack. Because y'all knew I had to get that one. And of course, this one doesn't want to open at all. help me I am so happy that um, a lot of people really they went and checked out the hedgehog hollow and a bunch of y'all actually placed orders <laughs> um, you know, like I said that was the first time I had ordered I have noticed I don't like all of the subscription kits so I'm just gonna follow like their previews and um, order them as they come out instead of doing like an active subscription like where I automatically get it because I don't always like all of the boxes um, it's based on what I saw so but I'm telling you that that sugar skull one oh, had my name all over it again $9.99 marked down to $2.49 <clears throat> these ones don't seem as thick as that one Love all the paw prints. <clears throat> Love all the kitty faces. Well, there's doggy face. Oh, look. 
I guess I'll figure out something to do with the dogs, but y'all know the kitty cats are where I'm at. So. Love, love, love. <clears throat> that kind of reminds me of my old Suave. I miss him. So anyway, so there is that one. And then I also got the Happy Planner Squad Life and Happy Illustrations. Fortunately, these ones don't have stickers to hold them closed, so we can speed through this. I like that there's random foiling through here. I love this one. So, I love that. So, that, so it looks like it covers the seasons, not the holidays, but the seasons. So there's fall, summer, and I didn't really notice spring, did y'all? Ooh, I like that. Ocean hair, ocean air and salty hair. Love this day. Hey y'all, be you. Yep, really like this one. These were normally $20 marked down to $4.99. And then this is the Happy Illustrations. Again, $20 marked down to $4.99. And this is a really pretty one. I, I really like this one. I had thought about picking up two of each, but I was like, nah, I'm a, oh, 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 I love, I love this. Every time I see little weenie dogs, I think of my sister because she adores dachshunds. They've had two. They're Rue, uh, that sweet boy. He passed away last year. And now they have Olive, and she is, she's so sweet. She sits on her hind legs and puts her, and just sits pretty to get her treats. She's, she's just the sweetest. So that, oh, M, goodness. I might need another one of this one. So that is Happy Illustrations. So there are those. Then in the planners, I got the LOL. Uh, sticky notes for was $4.99 marked down to $1.24 really like that I love the little fortune cookie planet do it then I mentioned these I do not have a Cricut Joy I plan on getting one eventually maybe when the prices come down on them but they're deluxe paper um, they are adhesive backed. Apparently there are 10 sheets. So I'm assuming there's two of each design and yeah, 10 sheets, five patterns, two of each. They were $6.99 marked down to $1.74. And I got, because I love the patterns on this one so much, I got three of these. So these are the patterns that are in here. Looks like we have a solid like mustard. I think this is gorgeous. I just, I love the color palette on this one so much. So I got three of those. I got, there was only one of this one. I would have gotten more of this one too because I love the color palette. This one's called, I guess it's by Natalie Milan. I guess this is a designer. I have no idea. But all the blues and yellows, just absolutely gorgeous. And then I picked up this one that's called Moroccan. So these are by design, in the grove, and Moroccan. And uh, yeah, and there was a ton of this one. So I might pop in this weekend and if they have any more of this, I'm gonna grab another one or two. Cause I mean, that's a great price. So got those. They had these, these are called Absorbent Coloring Tool Combo Pack. They were $4.99, marked down to $1.24. Perfect for use with all-purpose ink and fireworks. Shimmery Craft Spray. So I'm not quite sure what these are, so we're going to open them up and find out. Maybe. Well, it doesn't want to come open. So we're going to 
make it. There we go. Yeah, I need to trim my nails down. Fantastics. Bullet tip. Well, that's nice. They're by Tusaneko. So I'm going to have to figure out what these do. If some of, someone knows, let me know. But for $1.24, I was going to try them out. They had a bunch of these, too. So, so there's that. They had these guys, uh, detail blending tools, so they're dual tip, and I got these to use with some pastels or with, um, you know, my chalks. These were $5.99, marked down to $1.49, so I got two of those. The... <clears throat> The bulk of the Jane Davenport was already sold out. I was kind of bummed, but I did get one of these. It's called a fine line brush pen. It was originally $12.99 and I got it for $3.24. So I got that. And they had some more of these um, matte gel pastels. They were marked down to $1.99. And I don't think I had the Pink Princess, so I got that. And I don't think I had the Noble Red. I'm not sure. And then they had the Monarch and they had the Ice Palace. And my th thinking was whatever I don't have, I'm going to put in a giveaway. So actually, I actually, I know who I'm going to give them to. So they are, um, I'm going to give the ones that I already have away. So there is that. <clears throat> and then in this haul, I'm just going to, well, I'm going to share some embossing folders and one die everything else um, is going to be in the part two and the part two actually has quite a bit in it I'm pretty excited about that one so I got this Tim Holtz thinlets this is a <clears throat> what do they call it anyway it was $16.99 marked down to $4.24 they call it doodle art, but I just think that's really pretty. I think that's going to make a really nice, like, um, background to uh, the front of a card. <clears throat> so we'll just go ahead and pull this one out. Let's see. Open this up. We'll stick that little bad boy in there. <clears throat> and so this is gonna cut into it's not gonna have it's not gonna cut all the way out um it's gonna cut into a sheet so unless you know you have a die that will cut the border out on this so I was really happy to get that for basically we'll just say five bucks so Got that. Come on, you can do it. There we go. So there's that one. And yeah, 424. Then I got these um, the 3D texture fades by Tim Holtz. Um, this one I got two because I'm sending one of these to my friend Carolina. Um, I've mentioned her before on the channel. I always forget the end of her channel, but she's Black Angel. Give me a second. We're going to find out because I always forget. She does tons of mixed media. So I got to move some of this so I can type. My bad. Sorry. Doop. What 
she no I'm gonna have to find her she's not popping up but anyway I'll put a link down to her channel um, in the description she does a lot of mixed media and um, we've kind of became friends at the beginning of my channel um, she found me and we just kind of hit it off from there Wow I now it's acting wonky but anyway she loves steampunk and stuff with gears and so when I saw this I immediately thought of her this one is called mechanics so I got one for me and I got one for her and for a dollar 99 you can't beat that and these are amazing um, embossing folders so I got those <clears throat> then I got this one is called kaleidoscope and so it just looks like it almost does look like a bunch of little kaleidoscopes. They could almost pass as, pass as snowflakes. And that's what popped in my head when I first saw them. So I, I'm planning on using this on some Christmas cards. And then, um, so this one was $7.99. But how interesting. They marked this one down to $2.49. And these to $1.99. And then the same thing with this one. But this one was marked $9.99. So, this one should actually have been 50 cents. I'm not going to complain because I didn't pay 8 bucks for it. And then this one, uh, $2.49. And this one is called Crackle. And it does kind of look like cracked glass. So, I got those. They had a lot of dies marked down. Um, if you're looking for nesting dies, they had a bunch of nesting dies marked down. I already have a bunch, so I just passed on all of those. And um, they had a lot of glimmer foil stuff marked down. I didn't get a lot because um, some of it I wasn't sure if I already had, and I just... I was just thinking, you know, I'm just going to get what I think I don't have. And if I missed out, well, then I missed out, you know, and I still got a great deal. But, uh, anywho, this is technically this is Hoppy Lobby Clearance Hall Part 2 because the first one I did a couple days ago was the beads. So the next one is going to have a lot of dyes. It's going to have some Cricut in there. It's going to have uh, a little bit of foil quill in there. And some stickers. Yeah. So, that, that is it. I'm, you see my little pile over here, my house mouse. I'm very upset with myself. Granted, I love this stamp here. But one of these is not, what is that? How do they sing it on Sesame Street? One of these is not like the other. This is a darn Stampendous stamp. It's not uh, Stamparosa. And, um, but I still love the, the image that's on it. And I think I have three that are coming in tomorrow. So I'm hoping if they all arrive... I will probably share that video so it'll be just a house mouse video on Saturday and then I still have my friend mail from Karen uh, um, from K is for Karen hey girl I haven't opened it yet because I want to open it with y'all and uh, but I can't actually set the box on the table because the things massive I had she it's huge it's ridiculous <laughs> ridiculous how big it is um, but I am so excited to see because I know it is full of sugar skull so I'm going to be on sugar skull like overload and it's going to I'm so I can't wait but I'm being a good girl and holding out for you guys um, anywho check your Hobby Lobbies um, ours is still like downloading or downloading uh, marking down in different departments but I've already decided I've I'm not going back. Um, there's a lot of stuff, again, that I would like, but I don't need, so I left it. And 
the beads. The only the only thing that would probably take me back is if they marked down Copics again, and we know that's not going to happen. That's like an almost never kind of deal there. So, yeah. So my next video will be my last uh, Hobby Lobby clearance. Um, hopefully, they'll probably mark down again, what, in January? I think they do that in January, February. So... And that'll have like Christmas stuff. So yeah, I'll be there for that. Anywho, um, I do plan on going back to Hobby Lobby next month uh, for <clears throat> some like Christmas sales. They had some and I, I was, I almost got it today or got it this week because it's the Christmas is 40% off, but I decided I'm going to wait. If I meant to have it, it'll still be there later. Anyway, I am just rambling on now so i'm gonna let y'all go i hope you guys have a fabulous friday and uh, i hope to see you again in my video tomorrow and with that i love you guys to pieces happy crafting Bye bye